morning. Welcome to our second or first full day of Disney. Today we're going to Magic Kingdom and we are wearing matching shirts. These are from Uniqlo. Last night everyone raves about the Uniqlo Disney t-shirts. Because we're literally that couple and we don't care. So I need to get my ears. So yeah, we figured we would start the day first day in matching t-shirts. We are ready. And Just got the uh, TV on the channel which shows us the park opening times and the weather and what time the shows are on with some Disney music on in the background while we're getting ready, which is nice. You can just see how hot it's gonna be already outside by the moisture on the window. Look at that. The trouble is it's so hard to prepare because when you're inside, you're in air con, so like in here, we've got like full air con. So you're like, oh, it's not too bad, it's a bit chill. I'm young, but you're And I know I'm gonna get outside, it's gonna be a <gasps> Hope you enjoy our first full day. It's exciting! You said hopefully you will enjoy it. I said hopefully they'll enjoy it. Oh, right. I was like, wait, we are going to Oh, we're going to enjoy it, yeah, 100%. But hopefully you'll enjoy it. Thanks for watching. See you when we get there. Bye! We just have a quick look around the gift shop while we're here. So Tony can try on some ears. Look at all these amazing mugs. Tony is about to lose it when she sees that we can get these in the hotel. Ooh, cooking stuff. I have these at home, which I use quite a lot. Don't have one of these, which I probably will get because that's amazing. Um, love the apron. Oh, I just love everything. Right, we really need to get our bus. Tony. She's got the bag. You sound like that mouth Well, that's understandable then. I think we're going to make it for the opening ceremony, which is at five to nine, so we need to get through quickly to the castle to see it. I'll edit that out. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it, look how amazing it is. The zombie marching band, well not zombie, but pumpkin marching band I should say. Woo! Oh my god, there oh my god, it's bigger than I ever thought it was. Look at that. Look at it. <laughs> it's bigger than I remember. Well, it's felt that I can take it in more this year. Oh my god, the Halloween decorations are amazing. Oh, I can't wait to show Claire. Claire, <laughs> you're gonna love this. <laughs> oh my god. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. <laughs> I'm not crying. You're crying. You literally can't put into words how big everything is and how amazing everything is. Like all these shops. It's not just like shop fronts. It's like it's not just theming for a shop front. It's actually all shops and arcades and restaurants oh, and. Look, you can see me there in that window besides that castle. Is that the Lego castle? Yeah. MJ. 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 Lego height. Lego take. This possibly has to be my favourite place on earth. And I know I'm a 27-year-old man, but I have no shame in admitting that. Like I said, I think I just, you just can't explain just how big everything is here. How clean it is and how pretty everything is. Yeah. 
and we're just, we're just, we're just going to get a picture with Memory Maker because with our tickets we've got Memory Maker included which basically includes all pictures around the park from official Disney photographers and on ride photos so that's going to be amazing. Are you ready for the opening ceremony? No. No? Are you going I mean, I, I've never seen it so I'm just like... Are you going to cry? I don't know. Very good, everyone, gather round. Welcome to this magical kingdom. My name is Tobias Quick of the Royal Majesty Makers. And I must say, I am thrilled to be here this morning, right in front of Cinderella Castle. Oh my goodness, look at the time. I better get right to it. <clears throat> it is hereby decreed that all are welcome in this happy place, where the young and the young at heart can explore and laugh and play together. Here, where magic awaits you around every corner, bursting with the joy and inspiration to make your dreams come true. And to officially welcome you today is the one, the only, Mickey Mouse! Actually, just cried at the opening ceremony. <laughs> the fireworks, the magic, the characters, the uh, all fairy feels. godmother, all the feels. <laughs> I just oh, I can't talk right now. Tony's still crying. I didn't expect that. Didn't expect to cry. I wasn't prepared for this. I wasn't. We missed the opening ceremony last year, so maybe we would have cried last year. But oh, I think yeah. we're more excited this year because well, we last just, year we were late and I ran down Main Street to get to Magic Kingdom to get to Crystal Palace so I kind of the whole beginning was kind of lost on me which was a shame so this time I'm actually going to take it in walk down Main Street take in the sight of seeing the Magic Kingdom to the castle yeah we are are going to Big Thunder Mountain now it was closed last year it was closed but now it's open last year there were two rides that were closed Big Thunder Mountain and it's a small world so we're going to do those first because yeah. then we've done everything at the park and we can start repeating it. Yeah, and then we can go to the very front of the park and start from the beginning <laughs> and work our way around <laughs> for the next 14 or so hours. And then we've got breakfast at uh, what time? 10.15 we've got breakfast at Be Our Guest which I was lucky to get. Literally about two weeks ago I was lucky to get that and it's one of the most sought after places to get a dining reservation in the whole of Disney World. And so, last year we had breakfast at Crystal Palace with Blue Bear and Friends, which we are still doing later on the trip. Yeah, so exactly. you'll see that. So, let's go find Big Thunder Mountain and start can having hear, fun. Can you hear Splash Mountain? I can hear Splash Mountain and that is my favourite ride. So we're going to do that a lot today. There it is. Oh my God, it's empty at the moment. See, log flumes are just all the child you feel anyway. Like Fort Park and Chessington. Yeah. Yeah, completely. Like every theme park has a lot of clues and just memories of that Fun fact, uh, I've got a hat in Splash Mountain which I lost. So it's probably still in that water somewhere. Yeah. From last year. Came off when I was in the tunnel. Ooh, only a ten minute wait for Big Thunder Mountain. I like that. Love the theming. Quite loud in here, so I don't know if you can hear me, but ooh, there it is! I know. Note to self, there's no aircon in here, so if we do decide to come later, remember that. Oh I know. Oh, 
fun. That was fun. Uh, very family fun. Very, very wholesome family fun. That was so fun! Instead of doing we Small World now, we're going to do okay. Splash Mountain as it's closing. Because if it wasn't closing, we would just do It's a Small World, but we don't have many chances to go on Splash Mountain, my favourite ride. I'm not going to film this one. I'm not actually going to film many other rides because I don't really feel safe holding my camera, especially on this ride, as it's a water ride. So that is probably understandable. Perfectly understandable. 15 minute wait. I like that. Are you excited for our favourite ride? Early morning cool down. Yeah. Better watch out for Br'er Bear and Br'er Fox. Yeah. They're a bit pesky, aren't they? Very. I don't think that was 15 minutes. No. Last chance to exit. Here we go, Splash Mountain. Splash Mountain done, not too wet. Nice little cool off. Yeah, it was, nice early morning cool. Yeah, it's about 10 to 10 at the moment, so we're currently walking to see if we can fit in It's a Small World before our breakfast reservation, and then see where the day takes us. Go hit up Tomorrowland, I think. Yeah. Bit of Space Mountain, bit of Monster Inc, Laugh Floor, and most well, importantly, like the, the People Mover. Oh. It's not actually too busy today. Considering it's August, I suppose a lot of the American kids have gone back to school, so a lot of the kids here at the moment are British. Um, and also, people say that at this time of the morning it's quite... Yeah, that's true. Very hot. But not too unbearable. No, that'll be later. Yeah, later it will get mad. Here we go. Hello. Could you give this to the person that put you on the right? I certainly can. Thank you. Oi! Tony! Our first red card of the trip. Some woman was given one earlier and she was so confused. What am I going to do? Red cards are basically an indication to let the people at the front of the queue know how long the queue is from the back of the queue. So they give them out all day to lots of people. So this definitely won't be the last one of the trip. Our carriage awaits. for breakfast now. We have three minutes or something to spare. And it's just here. Here we go. Be our guest. Let's do it. It's me. Rude. Thank you. If it focuses. Mm, yeah, 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 yeah,
the green stuff. Rich is doing the honours. Delicious. <laughs> like, it is really delicious. Like, not what I thought it was going to be like at all. Like, it's probably like the lightest buttercream I've ever had. Well, and you're the buttercream man. The buttercream boy. <laughs> Right here in the shop, and as you can see, it's crazy good. 